my name is Anne. I live in Santa Monica and Sunset Park, just off of Marine Street, uh, right up the hill from Marine Park. My grandparents bought the piece of property that I live on in 1920. They had a dairy. They had nine cows. My family has watched the growth of the airport and the area around this part of Santa Monica since 1920. In the 1940s and before that, when McDonnell Douglas was located at the airport, the homes were built around the airport to support the people who worked at McDonnell Douglas. So many, many of the homes that are built around the airport actually housed employees. My aunt was one of the Rosie the Riveters during World War II, and she worked there. That's really different from now. The airport does not employ local people in Santa Monica. There's very few local employees. And instead, it serves people in Beverly Hills and beyond who own the jets. It's too loud to have a conversation outside. The jets frequently turn and the planes frequently turn above our house, very low. We also have soot from the jets falling on our plants and our house so that you can see on our citrus trees how they have, um, how the soot collects in the leaves. If this is the effect that it has on our fruit and our vegetables, what's the effect that, of breathing this stuff in our lungs? My neighbors and I have lived here for decades. I've known many of the families on our street for many, many years. We want to see Santa Monica, and especially this part of Santa Monica, return to be a healthy, positive place for families. This is an airport for wealthy people, big jets, fractional jets, commercial jets, and flight schools. This airport does not serve the community in Santa Monica. It negatively affects the entire neighborhood, and I personally would like to see it dramatically reduced or closed.